So what is up guys, we are back with some more Pokemon Shield Nuzlocke and last time we left off coming into the mine number two and because I can't randomize like my run, I'm just gonna close my eyes and like run straight. I don't know what's over there yet, so hopefully we get something good and here we go. And we have a Shellos. And actually, funny enough, Shellos is like one of my favorite uh, water Pokemon. Wow, this is actually a bad matchup right there to have Growl without. Um, uh, dang. I guess we'll do Swift. I'm honestly like realizing like kind of I'm kind of tired of getting water Pokemon. <laughs> I'm getting a good amount of water Pokemon, and I guess it's kind of decent to have just in case we do end up losing teardrops or nikki um because gastrodon is actually a pretty strong pokemon to have on the team very reliable too but i hope everybody's doing well um i'm actually uploading this video late uh this monday morning last week i was out of town i had to travel for work so I didn't record enough videos like ahead of time to where I could upload them for you guys and I'm thinking since I have to go one more time uh, next month in February I'll most likely try to have a couple videos pre-recorded and set on a schedule for you guys to watch um, it'll be more fluid that way for you guys and then I don't have to try to come back and hurry up slash stress uh, <laughs> getting the videos out for you guys I really don't want you to use recovered. Yeah, thank you for using water pulse. Great, now we're gonna catch you because you've actually been trying to put in work on teardrops. Hey, there we go. We got Shellos. And now I have to come up with a nickname for Shellos. Oh. Uh, did I already call somebody Puddles? I feel like I already nicknamed someone Puddles before. I don't I don't know. Um I'll have to go back and check. It'll be really embarrassing if I've already nicknamed someone Puddles. Yeah, Puddles, and no, we're not gonna add you just because I guess we're pretty much fine with our team right now. Uh, one thing I like about this cave itself is it's a it's a good spot to kind of train up your team in a sense um it's probably a bad idea to have growl without but i'm trying to think what pokemon is actually out there um it's these things what are these things stun fists there we go <laughs> The stun fists are pretty good EXP. They're pretty strong too. Uh, they know counter as well. So I wanna, I want to see if I can lower your attack a bit, just because that's this. These stun fists, they hit pretty hard. I'm not even gonna lie. I just, I don't know why I even did a uh, tearful look, because I think it can only use counter if I use like a physical attack. Oh my gosh. Um. Whew, okay, we still outsped. <laughs> I was about to say, I was like, yo, don't tell me we're about to lose teardrops. Oh, that was a crit too. Okay, so what I think I'm going to do now is not even worry about that. Oh, yeah, see see how much EXP that was? This is like a great spot to just like get your team up to the mid-20s slash like late 20s. So, uh, do I have anything else to heal? I have, wow, I don't even have that many super potions. That's kind of sad. But okay, we're going to go into these fights. Um, try to get through this cave as quick as possible so we can meet up with the next gym, um, gym challenge leader.
Park Hole. Times four weakness. Bye bye. Sheetal getting them levels in. Proud of you. Oh, wait, I could have just fished right there. I don't know. Well, no, because then that kind of guarantees that I get a water type. I kind of want to just fight these stun fish just for the pure fact that it's good EXP to have, and it'll be pretty good to have for the next gym because he is no joke with his Arcanine, Ninetales, and um, uh, Evolution of the Centipede. <laughs> I can't even remember its freaking name. See, when I played through this game with, like, my grass starter, this cave was actually pretty tough. Um, because I think I had my grass starter as, like, the strongest one. And the stunt, the Galarian stun fist is, like, ground steel type, I believe. Oh, Zelda leveled up, too. See, I just need to get the, the stone for Zelda, though, because I'm really ready to have a Roserade. A Roserade would be pretty... Pretty great to have on the team. Zelda's already been putting in great work for us, especially with the last gym. It was an easy sweep. Give me all them EXPs. Oh, we know Fire Fang now. Uh, let's get rid of Lear. Let's go. When you're tired, you work up a battle. Boom, boom, boom. Timber, um, yeah, let's just send little old Sheetal out there to get our little, get our psychic on. I want to wait till it's like the right moment to showcase Nikki, and I'm thinking, um, once we make it like out of this cave, I'll probably use Nikki more. I've never really used, uh, a lantern before and I believe that's what it uh, evolves into so I'm really excited for that uh, see about this uh, water electric type Pokemon on the team so it's now it's a good coverage to have um, when we go up against flying type Pokemon I always say I'll come back to that, like that area, and like take my bike over there, and I never do. Oh, is it, is it a fight? I can't remember if we fight you guys or not. Yeah, it might be a fight. Yep, hop swept with us. What's good, Brody? One thing I do wish is, uh, I wish that we had more challenging, uh, teams to go up against, like evil teams. Team Yell to me is kind of, they're interesting, I'll say that. They're interesting, but I kind of just feel like it would have been better if we had, uh, an evil team that actually had a better purpose than just trying to help out, um, <laughs> one person. Yeah, we're going to use Tearful Look. Thiefel ain't no joke. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was a crit too? Okay, well I'm glad I... I lowered your stuff. But now I have to think about who I want to... 
switch out into, and I'm probably going to switch out into Serpex. I kind of just realized I don't have anything for, uh, I don't have anything really for dark type Pokemon. Oh, I have Sheetle, but Sheetle's also a psychic type, so it doesn't help that we have that weakness to dark. Maybe when it becomes Orbeetle, I'll feel more confident. And bro, you need to stop starting off with Wulu. I need something better than that out here with me. I don't care if you know Double Kick. You're not getting a stab from it. You're not even fighting type. Okay, level 25, Sheetle. Five more levels and we get a nice Ore Beetle. Ooh, see that does like nothing. At least on the line Una, it was like a times four effectiveness because it's the normal dark typing. I think right now my best bet is just to try to one hit that Pancham. Yep. So then we can just have a 2v1 with the Thievil. Oop, as long as it wasn't me. Wow, your tackle did basically as much as, uh, as much as that double kick did. Oh, that's how you choose to, you do that when you have one HP left though? I don't know, kind of weird to me. Uh, we are gonna heal up Sir Pex just because I don't need their their Pokemon just getting a nice a nice old good hit in. Yep, I had a feeling you're gonna go for Fury Swipes too. They always want to go for Fury Swipes. Ooh, and you got the five hits. Oh yeah, that definitely would have took Sir Pex out. So I'm glad I healed up on that one. Oops. Didn't mean to try to heal up there. We just gonna pluck away. You better not get a crit on any of these too. Nope. Oh, as soon as I say it, you get a crit. And why are you still doing five hits? Like, I never have that luck when I use Fury Swipes. It's like their Pokemon knew I was doing a Nuzlocke, so they're like, yeah, let's try to take his Pokemon out. Forget about Hop. Okay, that was... That was semi... Semi-difficult. It was just really about getting that Thievil and Linoon out. Cool, cool. I'd be like, wait, bro, like heal, heal up my team. Oh, okay, he did heal him up. Never mind. Do your thing, bro. Oop. Oh, that's good to have. Oh, excuse me, Krogok. I'm just trying to get these levels on these guys. Oh, a Drillbur. If you send out another pretty easy, chill ground type, I'll send out Nikki. 
Oh, you sent out Onyx. Yep, time to put Nikki out there. Huh. I don't know, that Pokemon Cry was kind of ugly. Boom, bam. Oh, so close for the level up. Sand Tomb, I don't believe I'll be using that at all. Unless maybe I'm trying to catch a Pokemon. See, Teardrop's almost hitting level 80. Or, why did I say 80? 30. I know why I said 80. I've been playing so much uh, Final Fantasy 14 online. It's a great game. I have a thing for MMORPGs. And I'm trying to get my Paladin to level 80 on there. Finally, we found, oh boy. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Tell me more. I was trying to think, because I was like, I don't think this area counts as like a, as a new, does it? Oh great, we got the amulet coin, I needed that. I'm trying to figure out, let me look at the map. I'm just, does the Motostoke outskirt? Yeah, that counts as a new area. So that means we can add another Pokemon on the team actually uh, so we're gonna try to be careful with this one and heal up teardrops while we go in for that because it looks like there's nothing but I don't know what that is chasing me Oop. there we are oh snap upon your this is actually really great because uh, I want that on my team. I'm just afraid of what move to use that'll take it out. Yeah, we'll do one more swift and then I think I'll throw the Pokeball. I already know what I'm gonna call you too. Okay, use your scary face. I don't care. Wow, that didn't catch you. I'm actually surprised. We have the, the levels over you. Well, maybe let me, let me use the dust ball. Maybe you just want a little bit more respect on your name. Yeah, you just wanted to be on something different. Okay, sweet. We got a pony. Um, so, it's funny because it's like adding... Adding Ponyard to the team. Oh, yeah. The nickname? I was going to go with Checkmate. Y'all are going to be like, oh, man, that's so lame. You named it Checkmate? Yes, I named her Checkmate. And honestly, I don't think I, mm. man, because this adds defense to the team. But I think for now, I'm going to swap out Sheetle for Checkmate. 
I don't know if that's going to be a good decision or not. But I don't know. I'm 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 liking it so far. Oh, you're slow. Boost the Pokemon's attack stats sharply when its stats are low. Okay, that's pretty good. I just wish you weren't slow. Don't I have someone else that's slow? Where where is the stats at? Who who else is? Yeah, you're both. Oh, you're timid. So you're actually fast. Oh, it's actually great that I have this nature on you. I don't know. <laughs> okay, yeah, it was it was teardrop that was also slow. But okay, we're gonna battle her because I don't want to miss a trainer. About to put in work on her real quick. Now oh, you and a, a little yamper. Well, hopefully Water Pulse takes you out. It'd be so awkward to swap out Sheetle with Checkmate just to lose teardrops and bring Sheetle back on. Uh, uh, oh yeah, this is the time for Nikki to shine. I, th I think it is, at least. Um, air cutter. Shouldn't do too much. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, and we got the paralysis. We about to outspeed you, bro. And you gone. I swear, Nikki is so, so clutch to have on the team now. I kind of want to take out Teardrops and get a different type. How you doing there? Oh, you have a Growlithe. I'm not, I don't know why I'm surprised. They always make it so... The officer-like characters always have like a growl of four bull pigs. And I like how I have Sucker Punch on teardrops and I like never use it. See, why do you have, why do you have like five Pokeballs on you but only one Pokemon? Let me let me put Nikki out there just just because we put in respect on Nikki's name. Oop. Those really weren't important to get. I just felt like it was a good time to pick those up. So now we're gonna head to the Badoo Inn. And I guess rest up. Ah, uh, does she want to battle us? Yep, giving it my all. Yep, she wants to battle. And I started off with Nikki too. I should have healed up and then started off with maybe Ponyard. I actually know. I guess it kind of worked out that I started off with. Nikki, I don't know. Poison fighting. See, we can probably try to go for the paralysis with Spark. We have the magnet too, so we deal extra. Oh! No, 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 no. Woo! We swapping you out. We need you, Nikki.
I actually forgot Krog learns revenge encounter. Even though it's a fighting time, I don't know why I forgot. More Pico was the electric, electric, uh, dark, and I don't know, I feel like, I guess, I've, I think teardrops, wait, no, why did I, why did I switch into water? It's not my fault. I was thinking stupidly there. I meant to put in Zelda. But I guess it's a good fake out to have them use a electric move. Yeah, because we're like, what now, bro? That didn't do anything. Yeah, I know you mad. A little salty. Is it bite or something? Oh crap, that... That did more than I expected it to do. Whoa, what? Oh my god! No! Why would you... Oh, why would you guys let her get a crit on that? Oh man. Zelda. <laughs> how do they let, how do they, oh my gosh. How do they let a critical hit come off that while you're in your electric, like your bite does an extremely large amount of damage. Oh my gosh. Oh man, I'm really trying to, f <laughs> because I don't want to lose Neo. <laughs> My best bet is what I should have did. I should have. I should heal up Nikki. Because Nikki is the only one that can save us. Thank you for taking that, that hit, my guy. Yeah, do another, do another Thundershock. So I can bubble beam you. Man, I did not want to lose Zelda. I can't remember if I have a grass type or not. Oh, that didn't even do that much damage. Oh man, I really wish I healed up now. I would have definitely probably sent out Ponyard. See, now we got a water pulse. We don't outspeed you? Come on. Huh. These level ups are still a little bittersweet. And then you have Scraggy. I would send out Sir Pex, but Sir Pex is paralyzed. 
So I think the only thing I really can do right now is just heal up teardrops and take it home for us. Oh man, I have to go through and think who I'm going to put on the team now. Let's see. Uh, we don't we don't use Sucker Punch enough. Tear, teardrops, we could definitely use U-Turn though. If I ever need to just hit and run real quick. Man. No, don't talk to me, Marnie. You just took out Zelda. Oh man, if only these heals would really matter. Mm-hmm. The next morning, yeah, yeah. Get it together. Appreciate it. Alrighty, let's... We, we now have to see... Uh, who to swap Zelda out with. Honestly, it's either get Sheetal back... Or I can pull out Shimmy Sham, which I'm probably going to do just because Shimmy Sham can learn grass moves. And I neglected Shimmy Sham before, and I guess this is payback for uh, <laughs> throwing him in the box as soon as we <laughs> caught a Pokemon we wanted. But guys, with that said, I'm going to end this episode off here. It's a little bittersweet losing Zelda after I was so hyped for leveling Zelda and hopefully getting a stone to evolve Zelda. But now we have Shimmy Sham on the team. We're going to need to get a Water Stone and a Fire Stone now just to evolve our Pokemon. But with that said, guys, take it easy. Subscribe to the channel. Helps out the channel a lot. Later.